All right, so I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to add um, rotating testimonials to your site. Um, and it doesn't necessarily require any code, but you can definitely do some styling to it if you want in CSS, with, with CSS rather, um, but you don't have to. So let me show you sort of the basic setup first. So I'm going to come down here to my not linked area and I'm going to add a new blog page. And instead of calling it blog, I'm going to call it testimonials. Okay, and then it's going to open up and I'm going to be able to create a post, quote unquote. Um, it won't really be a post. It won't affect you if you have a blog currently. This is a whole new thing and it'll kind of be hidden from um, your audience. It's just on the back end. We're kind of doing like a little cheat sheet workaround. So I'm not even going to, I mean, I guess I'll title it and say, you know, testimonial one. And then all I'm really doing is putting the testimonial in the excerpt here. So I'm going to grab my testimonial information, text rather, and I'm just pasting it in here. And maybe, you know, you can style this up a little bit based on, <coughs> oh my gosh, sorry, based on what you have in the, um, in this text editor here. So you can make it italic bold, et cetera, whatever you want to do. And then we'll just click save and publish. And then for the next one, you'll do the exact same thing. We'll add a new post, testimonial number two, and then throw that testimonial into um, your options area. Excerpt. Um, and I'm going to unbold this one too. Save and publish. Okay, so you can do that for however many testimonials you have. You see them over here kind of laid out like blog posts. Um, and again, no one will see this page, so don't worry about that. So now we'll go back to pages. And wherever you want to add your testimonials, um, you'll navigate to that page or that part of the page. So I'm adding them here to this part that says praise. And then all I'm going to do underneath this is I'm just going to drop in a content block, a little summary block. And I want it to be the carousel summary block. So in case you want to see sort of how I got there without typing it in, it's under summary and then carousel. And then I'm going to pull from my testimonials. So then under layout, what I'm going to do is I'm going to first I'm going to get rid of featured. You could, if you didn't have text here, put testimonials or praise or whatever you want to do. Um, and I think I'm only going to do one per row so that it rotates through. I think I want my text to align center. And I'm gonna probably get rid of that metadata because we really don't need it. Um, I think I'm also gonna get rid of the title because I don't really want that either. Okay. And so I think actually, you know, one of the things that you could do, you have this carousel where people can click through or it automatically scrolls for you, or you can set it up as, I'm gonna apply this one, or you can set it up so you can see here, people can, if I save it, people can now click like that and scroll through on their own. 